seven one when you were here. <laughs> yeah, having a. Yeah, you're gonna have to get on that mic. <laughs> I was gonna say having a different, having a different call letter would mess me up. I, you, you know, know what? It was actually easier than I thought. I don't know why. I just fell right into it, so it was okay. Uh, so again, Island 1069. Um, Gary, you brought by some friends. Um, Danielle mainly is who we're talking to. Uh, Danielle, uh, tell us, tell us why you're here. It's kind of interesting. I'm gonna let you you explain it. Cause it's it's really cool. Well, it's getting ready to snow where I'm from in Virginia Beach, and I am doing a handstand challenge where I do a handstand every day. And tomorrow is my day 1,000 handstands, so a thousand consecutive days of handstanding, and I wanted to do it somewhere warm, so I came here. <laughs> so that's that's really cool. A thousand days straight, you have not missed a single day of a handstand. I have not missed a single day. I even had a couple of weeks where I had a sprained ankle, and I still did it. You don't need your ankle yeah. to stand on your hand. So <laughs> now, when you say a handstand, you mean a full-on, not stand on your head, like a handstand. And for how long do you do it? Um, it depends, you know. Well, I know for the photo op, I, I, guess. <laughs> I, I I did it one time. I rode it all the way up an escalator at a mall. Ah, that's cool. <laughs> I think my longest handstand is like maybe a minute and a half, two minutes. Okay. Um, the you know what, Gary? Can you unplug this mic? I think that might be causing some of our problems. There we go. All right. Now, um, so tomorrow will be the one thousandth day in a row. Today's also a very special day for you. Yes, I turned 40 today. Yeah, congratulations. Happy birthday. <laughs> Happy Thank birthday. You. Um, so your timing, I was teasing you, was one day off. For the <laughs> I know. I didn't plan it. I was only going to do my challenge for a year. Oh, there and you then go. it ends up, I did the math, and I was like, well, what happens if I do it for a 1,000 days? And it just so happens to be like right at my birthday. So I decided to keep going. But I don't think I'm going to stop after tomorrow. Yeah, might How as can well. you? <laughs> like, make it 10 years. That would be so cool. Right. Now, tomorrow you plan to do your 1,000th at the southernmost point, right? Yes. yes. And uh, you guys invited some other local media reps, and uh, there's always a crowd there on Saturday. So are you excited? I'm excited, but I get nervous when there's a lot of people watching. So my <laughs> disclaimer is, <"Ey."> uh, <laughs> do uh, what time you plan on being there? Not, I mean, yeah, just tell Radio Land. <laughs> uh, I think we're gonna plan for three o'clock tomorrow. That'll be cool. So if you're yeah. ri out riding your bike tomorrow and you, you're Stop, near the southernmost point. And if you point, can handstand, handstand with me. <gasps> if you could get everybody out there to handstand. Anyone that can handstand, join yeah. me. I would love it. It's, it's the cool. handstand challenge. Uh, the handstand <laughs> challenge. That would be so cool. Southernmost point tomorrow around 3. Uh, go see Danielle. You can't miss Gary Eck. He's a fixture around town. And uh, uh, your thousandth day in a row of doing handstands. Now, I asked you, I'm like, what is this for? Charity? You know, we're in Key West. Everybody... Um, but it's you, just general awareness and something kind of cool to do, right? Well, yeah, I learned to handstand through yoga, but I tell everybody I started the challenge to get my heart above my head once a day, every day, because we all walk around society leading our heads, leading us, and so I want to start living my life leading it with my heart and passion. So huh. it's to get your heart above your head once a day, every day. Such a cool idea. Thank you. Well, thank Gary, thanks for bringing her by. That was such a, that's a, that's a neat thing, something different and natural and doesn't involve, you know, being mean and everything no, else. Kindness so. is good, yes. Yeah, I mean, ask her what she does for work. Oh, okay. Gary says ask you what you do for work. All right, I'll keep it short. Uh, I'm a nerd in disguise. I work in an industry called electron microscopy. And so I work with scientists all over the East Coast using electron microscopes to image things at the atomic level. That's all I'm going to say because it's very nerdy. <laughs> <laughs> are you working on the microscopes? Are you showing them how to use them? Are you? I can are do you, everything. I are you microscoping electrons yourself? Or are you? <laughs> well, the, the electrons are used to image oh, atoms, and so you're imaging atoms. Oh, you're looking at little teeny tiny, tiny atoms. Tiny yes. <laughs> you are a nerd, but in the best way. Go girl science. And the handstanding. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and the handstanding. That's very cool. So uh, it's very nice to meet you, oh, and nice meet you. I can't Thank wait to you. see you all over Facebook tomorrow. Uh, I oh, it see will be. If I'm, if I'm in the area, I'm certainly going to stop by, but don't, no, no handstand. I, I, I do this. I take the photos. So. Awesome. <laughs> she can, can check it out you. on Facebook, tell her 1,000. Oh, yeah, we're on your Facebook page? Oh, my Facebook page is just 1,000 handstands. Perfect. The number 1,000? The number 1,000. Okay, so that's easy enough. Yay. Well, that's cool. How fun is that? Where's the, uh, you, you told me one cool handstand you did. Tell, you could tell that one. The, oh, up the escalator? Yeah, so yes. Yes, I rode it all the way up on the escalator on the mall. I think that was day 64. And then what's some other weird ones you've done? Mm, I did one once on a Harley Davidson, parked, it wasn't oh. moving. <laughs> I was going to say, though, no, that takes skill. Um, Japan. Yeah, I, I was in Japan and I was also in Israel. I did handstands over there. 
Um, I did one on the beach in Rio de Janeiro. That was awesome. Uh, oh, oh, nice. Yeah. <laughs> and then southernmost point in the continental United States. That's yep. Too cool. Where'd you do one yesterday? Yesterday. Oh gosh, we did a whole bunch yesterday. Where were we yesterday? <clears throat> you met Peter Fonda. Wait. Oh, oh yeah. you oh. met Peter I Fonda. I met Peter Fonda. In, uh, uh, where were um, you? Norman Reedus. Yeah. That, he, the guy from Walking Dead. Yeah. Yeah. We were at um, uh, Hogfish. Awesome, awesome restaurant. An awesome restaurant. That's where we met him. Um, I did a handstand there, and I, we also drove up to Bud and Mary's because yep. uh, our friends wanted us to pick up a T-shirt from there. So I did oh. one up there. Um, how many did others did I do? It, it, we lose track. We, we do more track. than one every day. Yeah, I did a whole bunch two nights ago at Sunset As Pier. long as you do one every day, but sometimes yes. you do more. Yes. Depending on where you are, especially yes. look where you are. You're Check in the, it out. In the Florida Keys. It's beautiful. I know. It's awesome. So a thousand handstands on Facebook. Uh, be at the southernmost point tomorrow around three, and uh, meet Danielle and her team. Um, for the, the how did you meet Gary? How did you guys? Oh, your friend. Yeah. I I picked them up with a key lime taxi at the airport. I was the last taxi. They were the last four passengers, and then he said to me, "I know you," and I go, "I know you too." And that's when we realized we knew each other. She's just a bonus. <laughs> Too cool. Just an added bonus. Small we just got world. done doing one in front of the Wyland uh, Waterfront Brewery's uh, Wyland painting. Oh, nice. And I, I think as soon as you get some music playing, we're going to do one right here in front of you. I think it's perfect. Right, right? here in the on-air studio. Yay. All right. So uh, let's see. Let me look at what's coming up that would just sound so good with it. Um, I think we'll do some blur. We'll go a little old school and do some blur. And we'll play it right now. It's song number two. And, of course, you're listening to it on Island 106.9. Uh, Come on, Gary. Happy hour. Island Radio. <laughs> Gary, Happy hour. Happy hour. Here we go. Now, uh, another handstand coming up here in just a second. We'll post it on our Facebook page, Island 1069. There we go. Woohoo! I couldn't say Island 1069. That'd be safe. 1069. 1069. Let me get my phone, too. Yeah, get all the phones. I know, 1069. It's too funny.